Five. All set for the Champagne. A Breeders' Cup win in your end. And they're off. In between horses, smoking wicked has early speed, but here comes Moplex, and Moplex is ready to challenge at the rail. Here comes JJ Zozo, JJ Zozo, and now Tip Top Thomas. That's the leading duo as they get set to come out of the shoot well off the rail. JJ Zozo's in front is up by a full length. Then comes Tip Top Thomas watching the action here from second. In behind them is Colonel Bob, who's a shared third as Moplex is backing off the pace now by the far outside executive order. They are lined up there in that mid-pack grouping as at the rail their lethal speed. The two at the back after breaking on top, Smokin' Wicked and Chancer McPatrick had to catch up to the field is the trailer, but it's about six lengths back from a 22.47. Opening quarter mile, JJ Zozo has a half mile left to go and is now chased along by Tip Top Thomas, who's well within range. And here comes the move from Tip Top Thomas. Three wide executive order is moving forward as well. At the rail, there's Bacoma Rise, trying to keep up from fourth and Moplex. Chancer McPatrick has started this rally from the back end, was the trailer, but Chancer McPatrick is passing rivals quickly, and here comes Chancer McPatrick up on the outside. They're approaching a quarter mile left to go. The posted half mile time, 45.59. Three quarters in one minute, 11 and one, and the leader is Tip Top Thomas, but has to deal with Chancer McPatrick, who's rolling down the center of the racetrack. Tip Top Thomas to the inside. Chancer McPatrick with every shot to run this rival down, and now Chancer McPatrick is in front. A 16th left to go, was last, now first, and Chancer McPatrick wins the championship Payne impressively and punches his ticket to the Breeders' Cup. Chancer McPatrick wins it over Tip Top Thomas. Finishing third was Moplex in 1 minute 36.51.